How are you guys? My name is Moses Marsh and I'm back in the segment. Today I'm going to bring you the complete chicken house with the brooding area. So this is what I I did with the with the chicken house. I remolded it to to look like this. And uh this is a space that uh, I'm planning to to brood the chickens. So the house is already complete as you can see. I used the plastic mesh to avoid the paralysis of the small of the young chicks. And uh, the overall the overall flow of the house, I used this plastic mesh to to avoid the paralysis because the mesh that are made of steel are very very are not very nice for for the chicken feet. So this is the complete house. I decided to show you so that if you are willing to start a chicken house, maybe you can use this model that I've used. So these are battery cages, but the only advantage that you get from these cages is that uh, the cages are bigger and maybe cheaper if you have the materials so this is what i used i never used the 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 the, the nipple drinkers because they were not available in this area so i decided to use these metallic troughs and this is how it looks like um i decided to cement the floor so that uh, cleaning will be a bit easy and this is how it looks and see to put a door so that uh, cleaning and uh, getting manure to this small garden will be a bit easier as you can see this is a very very dry season the kales are not doing very well uh, so this is a place where the chicken droppings will be going and so the sweeping will be a bit easy so that the vaccination schedule and the electricity work is done so this is how it looks it has three areas the upper part the middle layer and the the lower area each cage i'm planning to put 10 chicken on each cage so as you can see these water troughs are detachable to prevent spread of diseases because as i noted from my previous water drinkers i used uh, one water drinker from this end to the other end so diseases were spread really easily so I decided to use those single ones. So after that, I decided to spray the whole the house. We sprayed it thoroughly. As you can see, we used a lot of a lot of chemicals to, to, to spray this house. So it's nicely done and it is disinfected very, very nicely. We did a very good work with for uh, spraying. Then I decided to 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 put diesel used diesel oil on these posts so that uh, to allow to discourage ants from from spreading to the chicken house because ants can be a very great problem to chicken houses and they can feed on small chicks and even kill them so we decided to oil the the chicken house using the used diesel used diesel oil and this is the new look so this is the complete look of the chicken house and uh, i'm planning to bring in a new batch of chicken because the house is ready it is disinfected everything is done and the house is very clean so we are going to just get go and get a new batch 